Yo, what is up guys? My name is Encrypted and welcome back to the channel. Today, I just quickly wanted to make a video discussing the new Days of Summer event they added to Black Ops 4, which really isn't all that new because they've actually had this event in previous Call of Duties. Uh, I believe Infinite Warfare, MWR, and maybe World War II. I don't know about that one, but uh, they've had this event before and it's just a little thing they like to throw uh, for the beginning of summer to celebrate. And uh, I think it's really cool. They usually add all kinds of new content and weapons, and they did the same thing this year. Uh, they added, they added quite a few new weapons. Let's see. They had the ballistic knives return. Uh, they added a new sniper rifle. Can't remember the name of it. Uh, they added the new assault rifle, which is also from Black Ops One, Black Ops Three, and I think that's it. It's from Black Ops One and Black Ops Three. It's the Grav, aka the Galil, the fan favorite assault rifle from those games. They added a new tactical rifle, which is called the Stingray, I believe. And uh, I actually haven't seen this one, but it sounds pretty dope. I don't know. Probably would be pretty cool. And last but not least, they added the SMG assault rifle hybrid that we all know and love from Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3, and now this game, the Peacekeeper. And, uh,. For those of you guys who don't know, it is a SMG assault rifle hybrid. It basically is the best of both worlds. Uh, you get the range of an AR and you get the fire rate of an SMG. It's just, it's such a dope gun. So powerful. It was really good in the old games and it's still just as good in this game, it looks like. I saw Dismo's new video and uh, he was showing it off and it just looks freaking powerful. Can't wait to get it. Oh, wait. That's right. I probably won't get it and neither will you because apparently they decided to revert to the old um, monetization system that they had in Black Ops 3 where basically you have to buy supply drops now to even have a chance to get any of these weapons. Uh, as far as I know they only give you one free bribe in this game. They do give you the new uh, sniper rifle I think from hitting tier 50 but who wants a fucking sniper rifle? <laughs> I mean seriously like we all want the peacekeeper and the, the grab and maybe the ballistic knives. No one wants the friggin' sniper rifle. Um, it's not even like a traditional sniper either. It's like a three-shot kill, uh, you know, semi-auto. It's more of a tactical rifle, if you ask me. But, um, yeah, you do unlock that for sure. But they give you a weapon bribe, which could give you... It could give you what you want, or it could give you a weapon you don't want. And uh, I just think that's so scummy of them. Because they had the system so good, in my opinion, at least in this game. Uh, from the beginning, you know, they had the whole tier system where... If you wanted the, you know, weapons or guns, all you had to do is unlock all the weapons in the tier system. But now you have to buy them with supply drops, and that just sucks. I mean, seriously. From what I can see, the community is not too happy about it, but what can we do, right? I mean, we've been telling them for years we don't like this, but it doesn't really do anything. So, I guess we'll just have to live with it and hope to God that they give us plenty of weapon bribes throughout the, uh, throughout the rest of the game's life cycle, I guess. Um, but anyways, guys, uh, that's all I really wanted to talk about. I just wanted to bring up the new weapons and, uh, tell everyone, you know, the Days of Summer thing is here. I don't know what else they have planned. I'm assuming probably, like, double XP, I guess. I'd imagine they'll probably have double XP. But, uh, other than that, I don't know. They could have all kinds of stuff in store for us. So, I guess that's it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed, please feel free to hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new for new Call of Duty content. I have all kinds planned for the future, especially if I manage to get these weapons, which I probably won't, but what are you going to do, right? Anyways, guys, I will see you in the next video. I hope you have a great day, and peace!